extremely windy and extremely cold. Today was a pain in the ass to walk. But that's not what this video is about. Let me paint the picture for you. My daughter's friend comes up today and she brought a gift over for the family. Mm-hmm. She brought a whole container of cookies. Now they was, this thing was full. Everybody but me has been eating them. You remember my last video? I said I ain't gonna eat no more cookies or ice cream or anything sweet for at least 31 days. And she brings this. What gives? Now I got the cookies outside right now because it's hard to make a video indoors because a lot of noise going on, a lot of people. So the cookies are out here probably going to get frostbit. And look at my dog. Well, she's taking off down there now, but she was sniffing them. She was sniffing them. <laughs> but seriously, what gives? This has been on my stove now for about four hours. Mmm, they do look good. <sighs> Just to have one cookie but I won't no do you know the willpower it takes to say no to that you know how hard it is just to say no I won't do it because I'm gonna make damn sure I go these 31 days without any type of sweet at all I tell you what though today is day number four of no sweets none of it and it's not as bad as I thought the only time I have trouble is like Oh, I can smell these cookies. <laughs> these damn things. I should put the lid on them, huh? I'm standing over here and I still can smell these damn things. Oh, man, they smell good. Okay, okay, I gotta back away. Guys, I gotta put these inside. Okay, if you can hear me over my barking dog, which actually stopped barking. Oh, there she goes again. The temptation, knowing they're in there. Now... The day I made that rule up, I'm going to quit all sweets, I asked my family. I asked my kids. I said, if you bring sweets in the house, hide them from me. If you are going to eat sweets, eat them in another room when it's not around me. What happens? That thing's sitting on the kitchen stove. Before I went walking in this frigid, frigid weather, I asked them, I was like, can you please, before I get home, have these somewhere else? Think they listen? No. I said, well, hell, at least eat the damn things up. Don't let me see them. I do know my youngest gets home from school. He'll probably nail about four. Then Justin, he'll probably nail a couple. My wife's nailed a few. So there's only a few left. That was full. She brought down a whole container. I'm naming the video, Can I Have Just One? You know the temptations of that, though. But I know, I know. If I eat that one, that's just going to blow everything I had planned. But guys, I wasn't going to make a video about these cookies today, or about the sweets. I actually was going to make another video, which will go up probably the next time I make a video. But these things came in, and I was like, nah, i got to throw it up to YouTube, because it's what I do. I throw it up, and I told you I'm going to let you guys know as I go along, and see if I can handle for 31 days. Now, I was, I was sitting there thinking, after my 31 days are up, I will allow myself to have sweets, but only in moderation. Today was a challenge for me walking, guys. I walked outdoors. Now, right now, it looks like a beautiful day. You wouldn't think it, but it's 23 degrees. When that wind blows, it takes it down to 15. It kicked my butt today. I was one mile short of my normal walk. I had to stop. The wind just got too dang much. Uh, but anyway, guys, what would you do if somebody brought in a whole thing of cookies and you're trying to quit sweets would you sneak and eat one would you uh get mad and throw them on the garbage or pretty much do what i'm doing trying to stay away from them but you know what though as much as i want them my willpower won't let me no so guys until next time next video will probably be done on the green screen we got snow coming hmm I might do something with that. So until next time, come on. Let's get out of here. I got to get this dang dog up. She gets back there and she never wants to come up. Just saying.